Okay, so in this video I'm going to teach you how to make a really small fuzz pedal on a breadboard using 10 things. Four of those 10 things are these wires. So these are jumper wires. You got red for 9 volt, yellow for output, blue for input, black for ground. You got a very small breadboard. So it's one of the smallest breadboards you can get. Uh, a transistor, which is an MPS A13 transistor. A diode, which is a, a 4148 diode, 100 nanofarad capacitor, a 10k resistor, and a 2.2 UF capacitor. You can use electrolytic capacitors, but this is the only one I had, and it seems to work. I'm going to put this all together and then show you how it works. Okay, so first I'm going to get the transistor, and you want the flat side, because it's got a flat and a rounded side. Put flat side into the breadboard. Then I'm going to get the 2.2 UF capacitor. That's going to go from the middle leg of the transistor and then that's going to eventually go to the input. Then we're going to get the diode and you want the negative side of the diode to go to the middle leg and the positive to go to the third leg. And then we're going to get the 100 nanofarad capacitor, that's going to go from the third leg and that will eventually go to our input. And then the 10k resistor is also going to go from the third leg and that's going to make, um, that's going to go to the 9 volt. Okay, so that's all the components in. So, as I said, the 10k goes to the 9 volt. The first leg of this transistor goes to ground. The leg of the uh, 100 nanofarad goes to the output and the, t the other side of this capacitor goes to the input. So it looks like this. Now like I say, this input goes to the input like jack. Uh, sorry, that's the output jack. That goes to the input jack. That goes for like the ground, so that the the ground of your battery, and then that goes to the nine volt of your battery. It's simple as that. But what I've got, I have a test box, um, and this basically has a stomp switch and LED, an input and output, and then the four crocodile clips here, which. Um, go to the corresponding leads, so I'll just snap those on. So my input, and then my ground. And so I'm going to go for the input, goes into my guitar, and the output goes to the amp. So I've just got everything wired up there um, to the test box, and then this is going to my orange micro dock through a 4x12 Marshall. So I'll just give you the clean tone. Pretty clean ish. Then I'll uh, activate the stomp switch. pretty much how you make a guitar effects pedal with five components or ten with the breadboard and leads.